Hey everybody, it started out on Thursday, um, the 18th, and now it's Friday, but, um, the 19th, I'm distracted here, I'm looking at, um, a lot of traffic that's leaving the pad, the grand hiatus. What happened was a big mystery. I was down at the pad shooting in that rainstorm earlier and uh, had set up about four or five different shots and it just started pouring. And it uh, didn't look at nine o'clock like, I mean, the pad was just pumping with activity. It was really getting busy down there and it looked like they were gonna work all night. So I just ignored the time, and like before I knew it, it was like nine o'clock. So I beat feet down here for the uh, LBJ Boulevard for the hard checkpoint and uh, set up. I've been talking to my wingmen, some guys on the chat, um, uh, the Lab Padre chat. We got uh, the uh, I'm in the Snake Pit area where I I filmed the. Uh, SN6 hop and uh, the reason we call it the snake pit is because there is a pig's rattlesnake den and they actually rattle at you if you move around too much if you get on the wrong side of them they're in the grass and you're over in the in the car park um, sandy area so I came down here to sorry about that I came down here to the snake pit and uh, set up across from Fen Park and uh, the weather cleared. Uh, a little bit of um, fog bank clouds. I'd say about uh, 500 feet, maybe 400. The drone's been flying around clearing. The uh, fire truck went down once. Did some sniffing after that uh, tanker left. Somebody stuck in the mud back here behind me. Somebody stuck in the mud back there. And uh, he's getting more stuck as, as we speak. Uh, employees are kind of parking along the roadbed. I am surprised to see employees parked. They might be sleeping in their cars because they got to get to work the next day. I keep hitting the camera, I'm sorry. Um, and uh, there's a lot of security going around right now. I was chilling. And then when I saw all the cars streaming by, I realized I better take a peek what's going on. This is the mystery shoot. Nobody knows. Is it gonna pop off the top? Is it gonna pop at all? I uh, mentioned in the uh, uh, late Monday, early Tuesday morning shoot of the uh, first uh, test to failure, uh, pressure test to failure, that it was like a pregnant woman you just don't know when it's going to happen but you know it's going to happen so this um tank this sn 7.1 is sitting down there uh with a couple more people on the pad it's not completely cleared yet but it got busy here and uh we will check back in with you in about uh half hour see what's going on well I'm pretty sure if it's gonna be pressurized they're gonna to have to have a siren we have we had an over uh, we had a tank once that was a inconsequential uh, pressure test and something went wrong and it cracked our front window the seal on our front front window so after that they started sending out notices and it, it just got over pressurized and, uh, and they did a detank I guess. I'm not sure how that happened because I was asleep in those days and uh, we thought it had been cancelled. We, we all went to bed and everybody went home and we thought it was done. And about two hours later kaboom. Anyway we will check back in about a half hour. Uh, still no venting. Oh yeah, there's just starting 
to vent out of the lux tanks. So we got something going on here. And it's been fun watching all week. I know I'm going to like looking back on these 10 years from now and just think, hmm, I so old timey, old school, but we sure had fun doing it. Guessing and ang excitement and waiting on, uh, waiting for tweets and uh, nicknaming things. Well, it's the first time I've come back and started filming without the mosquito truck either just passing or coming to. So maybe he gave up. <laughs> A lot of the employees gave up. It's just me out here, and uh, it's really quiet. It's just the crickets, and uh, they're really loud. Okay, it's 2.55, and it's very quiet out. It stopped venting shortly after I took that last clip and then this started so we're back up and running yeah that looks cool It's getting cold. Not the temperature with me. No, the temperature on the tank is looks like it's getting chilled down. Well, we have a problem. They've got the forklift, or the uh, man lift, the um, Carl to some, K-A-A-R-L. Anyway, they quit uh, pressurizing, and now they're looking at something. I just can't help but wonder if they got the bailing wire and they're reaming out the the valve. The well folks, that's it for uh, the SN 7.1 pressurized test till failure. Um, it's uh, 15 till 6, the road's open, people are heading down, um, getting ready for the, the next shift, uh, a lot of engineers coming back from the uh, last failed, I think, was it three times? I lost track, but anyway, people seem to really get a, a lot out of watching these 
these these tests because I, I learn a lot. Uh, I chat a lot. I'm out here talking to quite a few people, and it looks like I'm talking to myself. But there's uh, a lot you're learning while you're watching these things. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. It was um, another night watch with first neighbor Maria Pointer. So until the next test, adios.